What is up guys? It is your boy Main Mania and welcome back to Mortal Kombat Mobile. Today's video is going to be a nice short video, but it's a pretty helpful tip for those of you who would like to max out your feats of strength on your characters. So, for example, if we are to go to Liu Kang, and there are several characters in the game like this, um, a lot of these characters require 250 x-rays or fatal blows in order to get one of their feats of strength buffs. In Liu Kang's case, uh, he will be rewarded with 2% power gen for each of the four different tiers, giving you a max 8% extra bonus power gen in your matches on that version of Liu Kang. So, I'm always working on my feats of strength as I enter battles and enter towers. I always look at the enemy team I try to see what they have or what characters that they have because some of the feats of strength in this game are extremely, extremely frustrating. All my top characters though, well, not all my top characters, but all my favorite characters, all their feats of strength are fully maxed out. Some of the feats of strength in this game are pretty tedious. For example, knock out 500 Melinas. So once again, these are things to be conscious of as you're playing the game, guys. If you see a Melina on the enemy team, switch off to a katana or a character that can benefit from killing that melina so hey, back to the x-rays guys and the quickest and easiest way to farm 250 x-rays or fatal blows to max out that feat for those characters that require it the easiest way to do this guys is actually in battle mode so what you're going to want to do is you're going to go to battle mode and you're going to want to go to tower two okay in tower two once again uh what you should do is you should save a bunch of different teams for the battle mode and characters that do require the feats of strength in these um teams right here i have scorpions raidens um and Liu Kangs for the most part because those characters either require a battle mode um feat you know where you have to win 500 battles in battle mode or uh they require both battle mode and 250 x-rays so uh, i'll give you an example of one of them i'm also working on my classic Liu Kang. so you can use certain characters to give them buffs but what i'm doing in this situation is i'm using kung shaolin Jin. kung jin for his passive uh his passive is all martial artists start with one bar of power the other characters that you can use for this if it's a spec ops character you can use balanced kenshi if it's an outworld character you can use mournful katana and if it is a martial artist you can use both shaolin kung jin and hellspawn scorpion so what you want to do is you want to use two pieces of equipment that are going to also give them a bar of power i'm using the wrath hammer and the bloody tomahawk as my two pieces of equipment on classic Liu Kang, and then you're using the character that offers the buff, which will give him his third bar of power. From here, guys, it's really simple. Uh, if that character requires 500 battles in battle mode, even better because you're knocking out two feats for the price of one. From here, you're starting with an X-ray, put the game in auto, and everything just works itself out. Your character will automatically use their X-ray at the beginning of the match and hands-free the auto battle mode will go ahead and finish the rest of the battle for you so this is a great way to farm your characters as feats of strength if you're watching tv if you're watching youtube if you're watching netflix or if you're just doing something that you know requires you to not actively be playing uh, this is just a great way to get some battles in i don't sit here and do this for hours upon hours to get my characters you know the 500 battles they need in battle mode what I do is, you know, when I log into the game, I'll just do this for, um, you know, any kind of spare time that I have, or if I'm editing videos and videos are rendering for YouTube, things of that nature, I'll just go ahead and do 10 battles at a time. I don't expect to do this for everybody, you know, and get to the 500 in one day. I just do little by little. And like I said, I have multiple battle mode teams and I just keep working on those characters little by little. So guys definitely work on your feats of strength it's a really nice and easy way to get some really small but still meaningful buffs to uh some of your best character cards in your collection uh, i hope this strategy is helpful for you guys uh when you do complete all five battles in tower two 
you're gonna wanna restart tower two over and over and over again. This is the second tower in battle mode. And once again, it is the best way because not only are the enemies easy to beat, but it's the quickest way and it only drains one small little bar of the uh, life power, like this bar. It only takes one of these. As you move up in other towers in battle mode, some of them will start taking two. And on top of that, some of them will include fee uh, tester mites, which do nothing for you. So this is the best tower to, to use it for. You can easily get 250 x-rays. Uh, what I'm planning to do is as soon as my classic Liu Kang gets his 250 x-rays, I'm just going to swap. Now I'm going to work on MK11 Scorpion. I'm going to switch my equipment over to MK11 Scorpion, and I'm going to go ahead and get him his 250 x-rays while they all get their 500 battles, which will get them that other feat of strength maxed out. So yeah, guys, uh, hopefully you guys found this helpful. This is a great way to farm both your battle mode wins and your 250 x-rays to max out those feats of strength for your characters and help your characters become stronger cards. So hopefully you guys found this helpful. If you did find this helpful, please do not forget to hit that like button. In addition to that, if you guys are new to the channel, please don't forget to subscribe. I've got plenty of Mortal Kombat mobile content and I've got so much more to come. So if you haven't yet, go ahead and check out my MK Mobile playlist. Plenty of videos to check out in that. And in addition to that, go ahead and check out some of my other games that I play and the other content that I have. My channel is extremely organized, so go ahead and go through those playlists. I'm sure you guys are going to find a game that you guys are going to love watching. So once again, I want to thank you guys for coming through. I hope you found this video helpful. It's your boy Main Mania. Thank you for watching, and I'm out. Peace.